First on five, it's a busy week for the Mobile County Public School System. High school graduations are taking place during this pandemic. Of course, precautions are in place. News 5's Gabby Easterwood joins us now live from Lad People Stadium, where the first commencement ceremony took place earlier today. Gabby? Thanks a lot, Peter. And that's right. We actually visited Williamson High School's graduation earlier today to get a better understanding of these guidelines and just how they're being played out for everyone's safety. Graduation, something Mobile County Public School System just weeks ago thought wouldn't be possible for their students. We are so happy to be able to do this for them. The kids are excited um, that they do get to put on that cap and gown because there was a time when they didn't know if they were going to be able to wear it. Things are anything but normal for these ceremonies. Ceremonies are different from any other ceremony we've ever had. We are maintaining social distancing, we're wearing masks, and uh, we're just giving students the moment that they deserve. Mobile County Public School System is taking it beyond just social distancing and wearing masks as well. The seats are six feet apart. We're doing social distancing. Um, there are sanit sanitation stations. Students will use hand sanitizer as they walk on the stage and then again as they walk off. Um, we've taken a lot of measures um, to keep people safe. And that safety isn't just for the students and faculty, but guests too. Each student was allowed to bring five guests and security was present to enforce distancing between those guests. For those graduating seniors, they are just excited for the opportunity to celebrate this achievement in front of their family and friends. It's very exciting to at least have a graduation. I hope everybody succeeds. Now, Williamson was only the beginning of this week's Mobile County Public School System's graduations. As you can see, Theodore High is getting ready to graduate in about just 30 minutes, and all those family and friends are waiting on that. So we'll see how the safety guidelines and social distancing play out for the rest of this week's graduations. Reporting live in Mobile, I'm Gabby Easterwood at WKRG News 5.